All right, a live shot here of the Don River where water levels are quite high right now. Take a look at how fast that water is moving. Now, the city is keeping a close eye at this area right now in case of some possible flooding, and they may have to shut down the expressway or Bayview Avenue. But right now, things were just, the city is just keeping a close eye. Be safe out there as there has been some localized pooling on certain roads in the area. And what a day it has been in southern Ontario. We got a lot of rainfall and it continues. And it's going to be continuing over the next few hours. Around 8 o'clock or so, taking a look here at our Futurecast map, we're going to be continuing to see some rainfall here in the city. Barrie getting a little bit of a mix. That's what the purple means. And then cottage country getting some flurry. So we're getting a little bit of everything in southern Ontario. And then nearing midnight, it's quite likely we're going to be seeing some freezing rain here in the city, which could cause some issues on those roads, making it very slippery. So it's a good idea to maybe keep off of those roads. Now, if you're wondering when there's going to be some relief in sight, at least here in Toronto, we might be seeing some, like I said, freezing rain and snow overnight, but things should be clearing up around Sunday, 9 a.m. or so, making room for a mix of sun and cloud. So good news to come. Just try to brave through these next few hours. Just maybe stay inside. Overnight, we are dropping down to minus three. Like I said, freezing rain and snow expected. And then in the morning, uh, we should be seeing some snow wrapping up by about eight or 9 a.m. Uh, and we're going to be seeing our warmest temperature around then, zero degrees. And then it will be cooling down in the afternoon, sitting around minus four, but the good news is it dries up. And then minus five around four with the wind chill, feeling more like minus nine. So make sure you bundle up if you are going outside. Don't let that sunshine fool you. A quick look here here at your seven day forecast. Sunday, zero degrees, windy conditions. Monday, overcast, two degrees. The good news is we're actually above seasonal from about Monday to Wednesday. Tuesday, we are expecting some rain and snow, four degrees though. And then Wednesday continues with that above seasonal temperatures, three degrees. Thursday cools down a bit. So the next couple of days looking pretty dry. Tuesday and Saturday is when we could expect some wet weather. That's a look at your seven day forecast.